778 BHP Teslas to race at Silverstone this August in first electric GT round. New electric championship will field 20 race spec model SP100DS, other race venues include Circuit de Catalunya and Nürburgring. Silverstone will host the inaugural round of the electric GT championship, EGD, on August 12th, the series boss has confirmed. Speaking exclusively to Autocar, CEO Mark Gemmel said the seven race championship, which will feature race prepared Tesla model SP100DS, will then move to TT Circuit Assen in the Netherlands on September 2nd, before going to the Nürburgring to race on its DTM circuit three weeks later. The following rounds will take place at Portugal's Algarve International Circuit, Misano in Italy and Barcelona Circuit de Catalunya. Francis Paul Richard will host the season's closing race on November 25th. Gemmel said the calendar was provisional so subject to change, but just final agreements from authorities were needed to solidify the dates. Electric GT has also confirmed the full specifications of its electric racing model, 20 of which will be built for the opening season. The battery-powered saloon has been renamed model SP100DL and produces 778 bhp and 734 pounds foot of torque. It can accelerate from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 2.1 SEC 0.3 SEC quicker than the road car and hit a top speed of 155 miles per hour. Despite running an unmodified drivetrain, the car's 100kWh battery pack is the largest in motorsport. Gemmel expects the factory specification hardware to be extremely reliable. The standard drivetrain is in a 25% lighter car, so the stresses are actually less than it has been designed for in the production vehicle, he said. This also makes the championship more valuable for Tesla Road customers, as our racing cars are closer to what they drive so you're essentially seeing a production vehicle on Circuit. Video, Tesla Model SP85D vs Caterham 620R Drag Race Pirelli is supplying the tires, which are 1.8 in in diameter, 265 mm wide at the front and 305 mm wide at the rear. Both slicks and treaded wet tires are available. A dual-circuit single-pedal hydraulic race brake setup has also been installed. The car sits on double wishbone pushrod operated front suspension, with twin dampers and springs at the back. The stripped-out cabin features an FIA roll cage and fire extinguisher. No weight figure has been released, but Gemmel's comments suggest around 525 kilograms has been removed from the car, which means it'll weigh close to 1,600 kilograms. At top speed, the car's racing bodywork produces 51 kilograms of downforce over the nose and 92 kilograms over the rear. The bodywork itself is made from high modulus carbon fiber a particularly fiber-dense version of the material. Race weekends will consist of a 20-minute practice session, 30 minutes of qualifying and 260 kilometers, 37 mile, races, one in the day and one at dusk. Races will feature standing starts, something Gemmel thinks will help make the event a unique spectacle. Seeing 20 of these cars launch off there about as fast or maybe even a bit faster than a Formula One car off the line, he said. I think people will be surprised by the noise. When you get 20 cars together, you do get an interesting sense of power. Each race will be streamable on YouTube, Twitch and Periscope, with a permanent live feed of every car's cockpit included.
Oh, 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 oh,